Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Penguin here. Thank you for stopping by. And today I'm gonna continue playing the medium that that jump scare in the bloody toilet bathtub was so nasty. So nasty. There's someone there. Reminds me of is Bumblebee. That is that you? Are you okay? What was that thing? Hello? Fine! Richard! Richard? No, sadness. The man I'm looking for is named Thomas. Who's Richard? He's on the day room. Are you trying to show me the way? Have I ever been behind the counter? I don't think so. Okay, where is the day room? The day room is in a seven, but it's closed. Wait, no, it's outside. I think it's outside. Here, I think. Oh, I don't like this. See? All right. What now? <laughs> I'm scared. Then again, he would say that, wouldn't he? Who is he? I feel like there's a, like a boss around here, and that one is just it's not even the scariest one. Hopefully not. I don't. I don't. I don't need more scary stuff. First Thomas, then Richard. Before I knew it, I was looking for a bunch of strangers. At least Sadness was still with me, in a way. Is that? Oh god, oh. it's everywhere. How many people died here? Can we just skip this? Oh my god, there's blood. 
Let me be frank. This case is problematic. My superiors want it to go away. I want it to go away. You can see how your statement complicates that? Comrade? I... Oh, I don't like that. Yes, I understand. Some things don't just go away. They stick. They echo. It's like he lined them up and just straight up killed them. Because this is the bloodiest place. The nurse, she did it. She killed them all. It was like something possessed her. Is that really what you want us to put on record? It's what I saw. Nurse. Like, how? She was really what? nice. But I guess she acted a little bit suspicious when she was taking on that wheelchair uh, patient. I think I'm allowed to enter the water or let's try. I don't think I'm allowed. It's really hot up there. Maybe I should push it back. No, there is nothing.
Cover your nose. Try not to look at him. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this place. Oh. Definitely didn't need to feel that. This is the for the patients, like washing, bathing for the patients. To keep you on me. Worried. <gasps> Girl, I'm the one who should be gasping. Ah, shit! Well, that's my seven years' bad luck. Ah, uh, something behind. There was something behind me. some kids here. You're not. Here I come. That voice. Is it sadness? Really? Come on, hurry. Oh, I hope they did not bully her. It's fine. 
I I'm sure they're here somewhere. No, Bernard wouldn't do that. He's nice. Oh, she's talking to herself again. What a freak. Hey, don't talk about her like that. So they bullied her. Some of them. It's dark in here. This isn't funny. I really don't think we should. Shut the heck up, Bernard. Guys! Oh, kids can be such assholes sometimes. Agreed. Show me something? What the hell? It looks back up at me. Snowdrop, huh? Why does that sound familiar? As I got closer to the mirror, I felt a slight tug in my pocket. I could tell there was more to that figurine than just carved wood. What mirror? I can feel it calling out to me. <laughs> Please. Oh, don't tell me he's coming again. It was the first time that it ever happened. I touched the mirror and crossed over to the other side. Are her powers getting stronger? Uh, what? What the hell is this place? where those bolt cutters are. So close, and yet so in a different reality.
Let's not go in there before, before looking at... Oh, God. What happened to you? Wait. I know you. You were that boy. Bernard, was it? He was trapped there, just like I was. I knew his name, but somehow that wasn't enough to send him away. It was like a part of him was missing. Spirit well. I could use some of that energy. I think it was the one who's doing the skin stuff is that monster. This was yours, wasn't it, Bernard? It's about time you got it back. I'm sorry you had to go through all of this. It's time for you to find peace. Bernard. Thank you. Huh. It kind of looks like the one I used to get through the mirror. Feels like it, too. Jeez. Tell me that. I have to die to learn it? 
Jeez. Thank you for nothing. Thank you for giving me nothing. between walls. There was no escaping it. There's those bolt cutters again. Gotta be a way to reach them. So close to it, so far away. What is this? Examination room. Great. Another mirror. details have emerged. The situation may be more complicated than we expected. No time to explain. We'll get the full report once I get back. Just leave it to me, comrade. Very meticulous of you, comrade. Locked. I'm a look around. There is nothing to look around. Oh god. Now. Shit. Bad nursey. There's more of them. What have they done to you? Just like Bernard. What are you? Stop! Ah! Ah! This is it. This is where he died. Okay. I still need his name. If only I could see the other side of this place. Oh, these hands. Some sort of a conference room. I gotta go. The voting's about to start. You know what they say. If you're early, you're on time. No, I mean right now. I can hear them gathering across the hallway. 
Yeah, yeah, I'll let you know how it went. That voice? That's the guy. Okay, no, I thought I was here. An attendance list. I'll bet the name I'm looking for is here on this page. But which one is it? Troika, okay, cost absent. Kucharski, Jan, Anthony. Nicholas, Helena. Anuta, Christina, Arthur, Boris. I don't know. Your good, your guess is good as mine. Zero five. How would I know what's his name? I can't believe they sat me across from Boris. Across? I don't Boris. care whose nephew he is. He's just a sexist pig for all I care. And late, as always. He's across the forest. Wait. Okay, that makes sense now. So. Boris is nine. He said across. Gonna be number four. Nicholas something something. I hope I'm right. here at least not in this world there we go
Okay, there's nothing I can do in here. Let's go. There's definitely something there. Oh, this does not look good. This does not look good. I'm getting close. That woman was here. Oh. She was a ballerina? Is it early there? This room has Guy written all over it. In big sloppy letters. Last one. I can barely feel my wrist. I don't care. I just want to go to bed. I need to be alone. Nice card. Was Vivienne one of your stars? Oh no. Let me let me let me let me check first. Let me check. Vivienne? Just Vivienne? The artist formerly known as Vivienne. <laughs> yeah, this wasn't her room. I'm guessing her manager's? That name, it's everywhere. But that wasn't the real you. There, that's her room. 
Someone couldn't even let her have her privacy. Damn, somebody was sneaking on, peeping on her? Ew. Disgusting. This is where it happened. Still no name. There's got to be something. Okay. Let's find out who you really were, Vivian. Huh. The page was torn out. I can't make out the numbers. At least the 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 puzzles aren't that hard to figure out, I guess. I guess one of these names belongs to your true self. But which one is it? Ellie and Tori. I still don't know her real name. Just words. Sounds without meaning. Partial numbers. Yes. One of these must have meant something to her. There. A bunch of numbers, some would say. But I sensed there was a lot more to them. George House, Nemo Resort. Ah, oh, the number to her lover. Yes, yes, mother. I know. I'm doing my best. What? No, I. Well, what about my hard work? It's not always about you. Don't call me Victoria. You know I hate that. Victoria? That was her given name. But not the real one. Not to her. Hello? Oh, hey. Are they asleep? It's fine. I know you're busy. I'm busy too. Yeah, it's tomorrow. The big day. Yep. Thanks. I'll see you home. Kiss them for me, okay? She was not married? exactly a hotbed of passion. Hello? Yes, this is Vivian. Room 347. I want to make a complaint. There was a man here. Yes, from the hotel staff. Frankly, I think I smelled vodka on his breath. He... What? That was the chief of staff? Uh, you Ew. know what? Never mind. <laughs> Thank you. Damn. Well, it's a stressful job, I guess. Oh my god, Ellie. I thought you were. No, no, I'm... I'm really happy to hear from you. Why didn't you call sooner? You did? But... Eugene, that slippery son of a bitch. Ellie. She was very special to her. You don't need to be a medium to see it. So... If you were talking to Ellie, that means... 
She is Tori. Tori. It's you. The real you. That's your name. It made sense, really. A name is more than what everyone calls you. It's what you feel yourself to be. Do I have to go back? Wait, so I can't go there. Wait, I should go for- wait, I forgot. It's a little bit confusing. I'm not gonna lie, it felt good. Putting that curse of mine to good use. Moments like that used to keep me going. Now, I'm not sure anymore. You can be free now, Tori. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. One down, one to go. Better get to it. Wait, how do I get his name?
I can't believe they sat me across from Boris. I don't care whose nephew he is. He's just a sexist pig for all I care. And late, as always. Boris. It should be number four, right? the guy he was talking about. Seek number nine. Okay. So this is Boris's seat. So the one I'm looking for is... This is it. The man I'm looking for. This is where he died. Oh, so the hut's out. Okay. That's it. Nicholas. Okay, Nick. Let's get you out of here. Okay, Nick. Please don't tell me he's here all as well. Okay, he's not. That's good. them away to a better place no anywhere is better than here <sighs> will you just let me pick you up already at least it's close by Being unreasonable to Peter Motley. I'm a nurse, not a nanny. I understand that he needs someone to keep an eye on her. Um, Mr. Turkowski, stay careful, stuff. There's, I try to do my best. Peter is quiet, he keeps to herself, mostly like mostly. I guess this is sadness.
this place. This wasn't this here. Started. This wasn't here. Or am I hallucinating? Hello, my love. It's your favorite nurse. Are you in there? Even the spirit you left. I oh. hope so. Because <gasps> I want you to feel oh my everything. God. The nurse. It got to her first. But why? But geez. I'd never felt darkness like that before. That thing had been there. It was where it made its first kill. Where it tasted death. And liked it. Empty eyes. My poor, poor Mr. Tukowski. Whatever happened to you? No signs of any brain tumor, dementia. I have this awful feeling there's no one looking back. Jeez. She took care of him, but also not at the same time. Kinda sounds like a spy name. Cutters. Bolt cutters. Or a movie star, like in a movie you don't use your real name for. <laughs> she's she's a little off there in a funny way. Spy name it is. Did I come from here? I remember this place.
Let's see what Sadness wanted me to see. I hope she's all right. Can I check that out? I'm a little bit lost. I think in here... It just rose. Um, that's it. All of that for that. I don't know if it was worth it. God. You're all right. I was so worried. <sighs> oh, yeah. That thing almost got me. What the hell is it? Uh, it came from shame. From helplessness. From rage. Rage? It's like anger, but more. Once it got out, we couldn't stop it. It ate all of them, Marianne. All of my friends. Your friends? I I'm the only one left. It's, it's okay, Sadness. I'm here now. No, no. It, it'll eat you too. It, just like the others. I won't let it hurt you, I promise. I 
don't want to see him. What? Why not? What, what do you remember? No. Don't tell them. Well, it, it's don't okay. tell anyone. You don't have to tell me. So but cool. you should still come with me so that I can keep you safe. No! No, Marianne! The sadness! Not never again! Why did you bring me here? Oh, this is bad. Because then I realized there was something she wanted me to see with my own eyes. Richard? Are you there? Gather round, children. I want you to meet Lillian. She's going to be joining our painting class. Uh, why can't I play with my friends, Uncle Richard? Your friends? Oh, Lillian, I... I promised your father you would spend some time with the other children. Friends? Don't you think he would be better off in a nursing home? What about his family? Richard doesn't have any family. Oh, the poor man. It's like he's somewhere else. We were close once, you know. I mean, not that close, but... All right. I'll take care of him. Hollow like a puppet. Isn't that what sadness said? So she drugged him way too much till he's nothing. Wow. Okay, this is it for me. Thank you for stopping by. Please leave a like and subscribe for more content. Thank you. Bye.